if you're looking to increase the engagement for your live streams then having your chat appear on your screen is one of the best ways to do that and so in this video i'm going to show you exactly how you're able to add a chat overlay for your youtube live streams utilizing bot rigs so jumping straight into the video the very first thing you want to do is come over to botrix.live and i'm going to make sure that i have a link to this down in the description below so that we guys can go ahead and follow along and so what you're going to want to do from here is you want to click on the option that says to log in with youtube now once you've logged in with your youtube account you'll be able to see this page right here you would know that your account is linked when you have your username up here right here and so on the left hand side we're going to go over to chatbot you want to make sure that it is turned on and you're going to go over to extras and then where it says chat alerts i like to go ahead and just turn it on and we're going to click on the option that says set up you are then going to make sure that everything is checked here this is basically just going to notify you if someone subscribes to your channel someone sends you a super chat someone joins as a member or gives you a membership so we're going to go ahead and click on confirm we're going to say yes and now we're going to come over to where it says widgets and we're going to go over to chat overlay and so this is where we're going to go to customize the overall look of our overlay now by default it's automatically going to bring up kick however we're going to go ahead and just turn this off we're going to turn on youtube once it refreshes and every time you make a change it's going to refresh on this page and so just to give you a quick overview as to what type of customizations that you have available to you you can add different types of animations so it does provide you with a decent bit of options and then you have your design so anything with a star by it you have to have the premium subscription for but if it doesn't have a star then you are able to utilize this for free you have an option to hide any bot messages you can add uh, better ttv or 7tv emotes if you want to hide any type of messages over a certain period of time you are able to go ahead and check this and then change the duration as to how long it can stay on your stream you can showcase whenever somebody decides to donate to you and so on and so forth so you do have a decent bit of customizations to have for your chat overlay and so once you have all that set and done you're going to go ahead you're going to click copy so that way you can actually paste this inside of your streaming software such as obs studio or streamlabs obs okay so i'm now inside of my streaming software that being obs studio and so what we're going to do from here is we're going to come over to the scene as to where i want my chat overlay to be and then we're going to go over to my sources now from here i'm going to click on the plus icon i'm going to come up to my browser source and i'm just going to name this chat overlay now you can name this whatever you like but this is what i'm going to put for mine and so i'm going to go ahead and click okay and i'm just going to paste the url that we got from botrix and so for the width i'm going to go ahead and give it 1920 by 1080 just so that way we can get the full perspective of our overlay and so i'm going to go ahead i'm going to click on okay and so there's one more thing that we need to do so we need to go ahead and go over to youtube so that way we can give botrix the permissions needed for it to display our chat okay so i'm now officially on my youtube channel as you can tell right here and so what we're going to do is we're going to come up to the top right hand corner we're going to click on our profile icon we're going to go over to our youtube studio and from here we're going to go to settings on the bottom left hand corner we're going to come over to community moderation we're going to go over to user management and from here you're going to go over to standard moderators and you want to make sure that you add bot rigs. Now, the way how you can do that, you can just type in their name and you want to make sure that it has this particular logo. So this is the one that you want to make sure you have selected. Once you have that selected, you can just click on save. And so now once that's done, you're going to come up to the top right hand corner. You're going to select create. You're going to go to go live and you want to make sure that your privacy is set to public. This is not going to work if you have it set to unlisted or private. So you have to be public. And so now once you have your title, your category, as well as everything else you want to have customized for your live stream, then you're now officially ready to go live. Okay, so we're now officially live on YouTube. We're going to give bot rigs just a couple of seconds for it to show up right here in chat. Now, if you are running into an issue to where bot rigs is not showing up in your chat, then what I recommend doing is just coming back over to the website 
go back over to chat bot turn it off and then turn it right back on come back to youtube and just give it a couple of seconds all right and you will now see that bot ricks has now been added into the chat and so you're now officially good to go so what you can do here is you can actually just do a test on your stream by just coming down here and you can just do testing and you will now see right down here on my screen that we now officially have our chat appearing on our screen now if you want to be able to resize this so that way you don't have this black line going all across your screen you can just come right back into your sources you can double click on a set source so it's gonna be a chat overlay and then you can just change the width personally i would do 425 by 960. click ok and now you will see that you got a nice neat overlay to showcase on your screen and you can put this wherever you want it and so with that being said that is how you're able to add a chat overlay for your youtube live streams and so if you found this helpful or if you made it to the end of this video, make sure you give this a big fat thumbs up. Make sure you guys go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And in case you want to learn the best settings for streaming utilizing OBS Studio, then make sure you click on this video right here. And I'll catch you guys in the comments below or in the next video.